हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वंस अगेन वेलकम टू भोलानाथ अकेडमी इन दिस वीडियो स्टूडेंट्स वी आर गोइंग टू सी द क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स इन क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स स्टूडेंट्स इट इज गिवन थ्री पॉइंट सेवन नाइन फाइव ग्राम थ्री पॉइंट सेवन नाइन फाइव ग्राम ऑफ सल्फर इज डिजॉल्व इन हंड्रेड ग्राम ऑफ कार्बन डाइसल्फाइड सो दिस इज द सॉल्वेंट एंड सल्फर इज द सल्यूट सो ये स्टूडेंट्स वेट ऑफ सल्फर इज गिवन दैट इज डब्ल्यू टू इज गिवन एंड हीज द वेट हंड्रेड ग्राम इज द वेट ऑफ सॉल्वेंट दैट इज डब्ल्यू वन इज गिवन The these solutions boils solution boils at three hundred and nineteen point eight one Kelvin. That is boil means difference. It is given it is given T B boiling point of solution T B is given difference three hundred nineteen point eight Kelvin. What is the molecular formula of sulfur in the solution? What will be the molecular formula of sulfur? The boiling point if the boiling point of carbon disulfide that is the boiling point uh, students again here tb boiling point temperature that is of the solvent so you have to put t0 so t0b is 319.45 kelvin understanding this is the boiling point of the solution and this is the boiling point of pure solvent that is carbon disulfide what else is given students boiling point co constant kb boiling point k stands for constant of carbon disulfide is given 2.4 kelvin kilogram per mole and the atomic mass is also given students sulfur is 32 okay students from these data students you are going to find the formula molecular formula of the sulfur understand students you have to calculate the molecular formula of the sulfur so very simple students for that students first you write down the if you know the molar mass students of the sulfur understanding you have to divide with the atomic mass students you will get the molecular mass understand students so what is the molecular weight of the sulfur first that we will calculate and we will divide with atomic mass of the sulfur so molecular mass we have to divide with atomic mass you will get the formula of the sulfur understanding students so for that students you have to calculate the molar mass of the solute how you are going to calculate students first to write down the uh, given data so first it is given 3.795 gram of sulfur that is the weight of sulfur is given that is solute is given 3.795 gram now it is 100 gram will be the weight of solvent understanding students the 100 gram is the weight of solvent now solution boil that is boiling point of solution is given 319.81 kelvin understand is unit is same students you have to keep pay attention on unit also what is the molecular formula of sulfur now what else is given boiling point of pure solvent that is carbon disulfide tb of 0 that is zero stands for solvent is 319.45 okay students so now see the quantity students solution Will be will always have higher quantity than the solvent. Understanding here, 0.45 here it is 0.81. The boiling point of sulf carbon disulfide is given. Now what else is given? Students here the Kb, K stands for constant of B stands for boiling point constant of carbon disulfide is given 2.42 Kelvin kilogram per mole. Understanding students. So we have to first calculate the molar mass. What will be the molar mass of the solute? Once you know the molar mass, students, you can calculate the number of atom in the molecules. If you want to calculate number of atom, you have to divide molar mass with atomic mass. Understanding which is given, atomic mass is given thirty two. Understanding students. So first students, we will calculate the molar mass. For that students, you should know delta T B. Now students, you have to take the difference. How you will take find the delta T B students? Delta T B that is boiling elevation in boiling point temperature is equals to you have to subtract boiling point of solution minus boiling point of solvent that is T zero B. Now, students, just put the value. Students, here three hundred and nineteen point eight one. You have to subtract three hundred and nineteen point four five. When you subtract, students, you will get here eleven minus five will be six, and here seven minus four will be three. Understanding three hundred minus zero. So this will be the elevation delta is nothing but elevation in boiling point temperature. Now you got understanding. Now, students, since you know you know the formula, how you are going to calculate molar mass of solute that is M two is equal to Boiling point constant into weight of solute into thousand upon weight of solvent into elevation in boiling point. This is the elevation. Understand, students? Just put the students on substitution. You will get the marks, students. Two point four two. Now weight of solute, students. It is given three point seven nine five thousand. You have to write write as it is divided by weight of solvent, students. Hundred into thirty. Point three six. Okay, students. Now, what happens, students? If you want to remove the decimal from here, you have to multiply by thousand. So it will come two point four two into three seven nine five. Okay, students. 
upon if you multiply it will becomes 36 understanding okay students now when you do with the help of the log table students you will get the value m2 value students you are going to get 255.1 gram per mole understanding this is the molar mass students but you have to calculate number of sulfur atom in molecule students so you have to divide students molar mass that is 255.1 with 32 when you divide students it will come approximately it is going to become 7.972 because it is 9 students you have to take you have to take 8 understanding students so it means the formula formula of sulfur will be in this molecule students will be s8 understanding students so this way students you will get the mass students this is coming for three mass questions students for examination they are asking for three mass questions understanding so first you have to calculate the molar mass of the solute and then afterwards you have to find out the number of sulfur atom in the molecule will be you have to divide molar mass by atomic mass you will get this that is equals to mostly eight so formula will be s8 understanding students if you like my video please share it subscribe it thank you thank you very much have a nice day god bless you